Hey everyone, welcome back to another video and today we are in one of my favorite restaurants in Hakka. We are here in Koreana. I honestly love their food and if you're looking for some good Korean food, this video is for you. Because I have been here multiple times, every time I'm craving something korean -y, this is the first place that comes to my mind and I'm here with a group of people which is good because you can split the bill and their portion size is quite big as you will see and we ordered a bunch of stuff and I'm super 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 excited. One of my favorite things here is their side dishes or banchan. So these are like the unlimited size. You finish them, they're going to give it back to you. You finish it, they're going to give it back to you. This is, I'll give it back to you when you refill. Hi, sorry, I'm too excited. This is like a spicy cucumber. This is their cabbage kimchi. This is radish. This is like a water spinach. Itao is a type of radish or pepe, something. Like, Egula K, honestly, pet Purajai, and these are superb. You don't need much. You don't need much, honestly. Like, you don't need much. You could order just like a bulgogi and rice and these sides, and they do the job. But we ordered a lot of things. Kabarachalage, we're gonna have the panchans or the side dishes. This is one of my favorite. This is like their spinach water spinach or something yeah kind of like morning glory it's very nice cold mm. type sesame very lightly seasoned salt sesame oil spicy cucumber ah rush falai this thing spicy tangy crunchy superb now next we're gonna be trying their cabbage kimchi one of my favorites kimchi is very subjective a lot of people don't like it because it's a bit too pungent for them at the sharatula first time so you have the option of like them cooking on your tabletop or they can like cook separately we took the separate because we ordered a lot of dishes and it's gonna get messy there our dishes are also here but let's look at this first the beef mm. so there's seafood do you see those raw garlic that's the best part they're gonna cook here and then after it's done they're gonna bring it to our table so this is our starters this is their crab potato cheese balls these are really good, it's deep fried. This is their prawn tempura. the starters. So let's break into this because this is super. Break it. Let's look at it. Cheese Nice. Potato balls. Sorry, crab. Sorry, crab. Thank you. Crab cheese balls. Look at the amount of crab meat here. Like it's full, full of crab meat. If I would recommend a starter from here, this would be it. Like, get this. Pretty big. They give you like the basic condiments to have it with the prawn timber and stuff, soy sauce, green chili sauce, ketchup. But I don't usually like condiments with my food. This is nice prawn timber, nice and nice and crispy, nice and prawn inside. Look at that prawn. Another of our side dish just arrived. This is also one of my go-to's: crab, cheese, finger rolls. Let me show you. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Karka Khana. This is their crab cheese finger rolls. You get like 10 pieces of these, you get 8 pieces of this, you get 8 pieces of the tempura as well. So the portion size is pretty good. So my defadu. Look at the cross section, it's so nice. Let's uh, try it. Soy sauce for your roll. Look at the cross section. Like there's carrots, radish, crab sticks, mayo, and then there is um, 
omelette, egg rolls, pretty nice. This is their honey crispy chicken. Look at that crispy nose. Yummy, yummy. Rahat already been salivating looking at that chicken. Ochahrata just. <laughs> Honey crispy fried chicken. I'm not a big fan of fried chicken or like sweet fried chicken, so let's see. Mm. I can see why people like it. It's a bit sweet, it's a bit savory. The skin is crispy but a bit sticky sticky because of the honey. Quite nice. If you like mixing your sweet with savory, I think you'll like the fried chicken. So this is our simmering, simmering hot seafood barbecue, assorted seafood barbecue. We have the beef spicy bulgogi going on here. Looks so nice. Just look at it. Mm. I wish you guys could smell what I'm smelling right now. Beautiful. Beautiful. So our tabletop is right here. Our bulgogi came. That's the bulgogi. Already and done. This is fried rice. I took steam rice because I prefer steam rice with these because it lets the food shine. So this is my steamed rice. Steam rice? Steam rice ta onek cute ekta pot e dai ora. Look at the pot. Cute. And it's like a lot of steamed rice. The quantity is a lot. Seafood. Steam rice diye mojha lage. Steam rice diye the gravies they shine more. Ooh. Ooh. Let's try the seafood assorted of barbecue. This is the seafood. Mm. Mm. So beautiful, spicy, that umami is garlicky, sweet. This is the cuttlefish, and it's not rubbery at all. It's a bit chewy because it's cuttlefish. It's so nice. Mm. This is super. These raw garlics that they put in their like bulgogi. I mean, I never thought I would like having like these whole garlics until I tried bulgogi. Let's try the beef. Their beef bulgogi is my favorite bulgogi in town. Their chicken bulgogi is quite nice as well. If you want to have some chicken, beef bulgogi, let's try it. Look at the thin cut of meat. Thin slices of beef. The beef bulgogi. Since we took both spicy bulgogi, they do taste a bit similar because it's the same sauce, my same marination, if you think about it, but still so nice. I got some lettuce to have my beef. So let's make a lettuce ball. We take a lettuce, a bit of ow, a bit of beef, lettuce, beef, rice, and then you can add kimchi, but I took a small lettuce, so I'm just going to have it on it. Yummy. Let's take a bigger leaf. Na shop chor chor. Bit of bulgogi, bit of rice. Cucumber. Sharatul or the first time. Sharatul, kya mala aksa tomar? Aapko chaba hai na? Sorry, tomar kya mala khali chaba na? Match kine jigo. My bad. First time at Koreana. Thank you. Uh, it's an amazing experience, especially the you know the cooking done in front of you. That's amazing, and the taste is very unique. I didn't have anything like this. So, yeah, for sure. I really like this fried chicken and the beef bulgogi. You heard it here. Abarajbe. This is the palate cleanser you get after finishing your food. So this is like Malta, so that you get all that gochujang bulgogi taste out of your food. Out of your mouth. Out of your mouth, not out of your food. So we're done with our meal and that was honestly one of the best meals ever. I might be biased because this is one of my favorite restaurants in town. Probably in the top three, if not top five. I've been wanting to do a video on them for such a long time. And after finally, like it happened out of the blue, and I am the happiest. I would honestly recommend this place to you guys if you're looking to try out new cuisines, if you're looking for a good place to have Korean food. If you want a very different food experience, definitely try this place out because I have been here multiple times and I have not been disappointed. 
Maje maje, the things you order you might not like because this is not like our cuisine. This is a different cuisine, so you might not like that taste. But if you once find what you like and what to order, I've never been disappointed here ever. So I stick to my guns. I know what to order, so I order those items specifically. And sometimes you can get to try cook the gale that one. But usually the same items, and I am always. Satisfied. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.